Once upon a time, there was a you. Yeah, you. No, not him. You. There she is, minding her own business, organizing the paperwork. It was that exact moment she knew that she messed up. Paper card. But that didn't stop her. She still has to go on and have her lunch. It was that exact moment she realized she messed up again. Beware of the hot ball. And then she decided that she wants to curl her hair with a curling iron. It was that exact moment she realized she messed up again. <laughs> My kids, if you don't know anything, the first thing you need to do when you burn yourself is run your hand under cold water. And then you need to have this handy handy ice gel that looks like a jello you will never want to eat again to apply it over the burnt area because that is helping with the inflammation to cool it down like literally what the name says is ice we all know in asian culture is bad if you have any scar on your face on your hand on your leg on your arms you are literally imperfect so moderma is going to be your savior so you're here because you're wondering what is that thing what is moderma scar gel does it actually work does it actually take out old and new scars does it leave any coloration how long does it take i want to see some real results well, you come to the right place. I'm here to share with you all my experiences and my reviews of the product. But before we get started, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and a subscribe if you like my introduction clip. Hey, I put in a lot of um, self-sacrifice in doing this. <laughs> So the story was I, you know, just like you, one day I was searching for something that can fix my scar, old and new. And this was the number one thing that came up on Amazon. And it has like four and a half stars with 10,799 reviews right now. I don't remember how much it was when I bought it, but it was also a very, very raging review. I was like, all right, let's give this a try. I always think of myself like a guinea pig guinea pig in the lab and i always love trying new things so this is one of them so the product is the moderma advanced scar gel and the tube that i got came in 0.7 ounce and it was priced at close to 15 dollars so it's not a very very cheap cream but it does the job so I always love reading the reviews on Amazon because sometimes people could be so funny and so real. So let's read some of them. These are some crazy reviews. This was back in 2018 in July. Five star review. Unfortunately, 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 I was hurt by my ex. He had hunted me and I had to get nine stitches across my face. It was a deep gas. You don't want to see the original picture before I was stitched up, trust me. Anyhow, back to the review. This stuff has actually truly improved my scar, car, since I've been applying it one to two times a day, morning and night, even though it says you don't have to do it. Once you notice a huge change in the structure of this scar, it's no longer deep, it's starting to fill in because as you can see, it was very deep. This incident happened in April 2018. Now back to the review. This stuff has actually truly improved my scar since I've been applying it and I noticed a huge change. Blah, blah, blah. Oh my God, this girl needs some spell check, but, and grammar check. Let's look at her pictures after stitching. Oh my God see the last picture it literally just looks like a really really light burned scar which i'm pretty sure she can get that out immediately after continuously applying the gel uh, there is a three star review that says these are pictures from august 27 to october 10 being the last picture i have taken it's almost going to be eight weeks and there has been a difference but not as much as i had expected it's a clear slimy gel that you rub on and for me it will peel off when it would dry 
It would also make my scar itchy when I would apply it, especially after it had fully dried. I started using the cream right after my wound fully closed off. I'm not sure if the improvement is actually all from the cream itself or also just the skin improving as it continues healing. There were some days I missed applying, but that wasn't often. I don't know if this is a normal expectation of what's supposed to happen, but I personally thought it would have changed more. I will update once a four weeks have passed. Huh, I don't know if she ever updated, but let's look at her picture. I don't see a huge difference though. Because I don't know what kind of thing she went through, unfortunately, but that looks quite painful. Anyways, two years ago, I was like you, looking for a scar cream that can help with my old and new wounds. And I tried on my old wounds. It didn't work so well, but then I wasn't religiously putting it on every day and so forth. But today, I'm positive if I keep applying it religiously, I will get rid of all my wounds if I want to. So as you can see in the intro video, I burned myself with my curling iron. Yes! That was real. Well, the clip wasn't real, but the accident was real. I burned myself literally right here. And I was getting ready for the Uncle Roger video, curling my hair for the first time ever in a long time. <laughs> and I just malfunctioned and I just like hit my hand for some reason. Probably it was this side. Left hand always malfunctions, you know? It's just like one of those moments when you burn your ears, burn your neck, and people think you got a hickey. So I screamed and I watered it. Water did. I run it through water and then I put the blue ice gel on it and right off the bat I was like this is going to leave me a horrible scar. Kind of like um, those bad stamps that people give you back in the slavery days. <clears throat> but that's what I feel like. I feel like I got enslaved by my curling iron on because it's burnt me. For the first day I let my wound settle down with my ice cream and the ice cream, quick review on that too, dries up, peels, tightens my skin so it itches. So I would wash it off and reapply as you see fit when you use that. But it is really great for calming down the inflammation on any burnt area. And then after the first day, I was like, okay, it looks like this can take the gel. And I started applying and within the week, this is the result. The first couple days it looks like that and my skin is starting to scale. I don't know if that is the right term. And then as I apply it every night, it started to peel. And when it peels, it is a clear skin underneath. I was so happy. After it peeled, now it, I just got a slight discoloration. And in the end, I got nothing. It's gone. So in the end, it was supposed to be right there. It's all, it's all gone. Maybe the light was a little, it's a little bright, but you know, you can't even see any discoloration on it anymore. So, what more do you want to hear? I'm a happy cat bird. <laughs> This video is not sponsored in any way. I just want to share my experience with this and how it's changed my life and has changed my point of view of looking at scars from now on. So, you gotta get this. If you have scars in places that you do not want to have it permanently, it's better to start early. The fresher the scar, the better it is. It does get itchy sometimes because if you think about it logically, when your skin is healing, it's moving. And when it's helping you heal, it's moving every cell, every piece of your surface skin, you know? So of course it's gonna get itchy, so don't scratch it because you're just gonna make it worse. And once you get through the moving of the skin, you're gonna have beautiful skin. So beauty comes with pain. In this case, itchiness. Aside from the itchiness, this thing doesn't smell, it has barely any color, just light yellowness, and does the trick. <laughs> and in conclusion, definitely recommend this product, go check it out if you would like, and I will see you guys on the next one. <laughs> it's kind of hard, I don't know how to pretend.